Hello YouTube! I am Pinstar and this is Pinstar Plays Overcrowd, commute em up. So, I was gonna dance around to a bunch of different games, but I was being indecisive and you guys uh, liked my first episode of Overcrowd so much, I figured, you know what, let's continue. This is still Pinstar Play levels of gameplay, I have not come anywhere near strategies and tactics level of mastery, but, you know, if you guys like this game enough, uh, maybe that will be my next research thing. I am currently researching uh, strategy and tactics for my upcoming Oxygen Not Included series which will be coming up uh, in the next week or so. But until then, let us continue. So if you remember from our first episode, we uh, uh, technically completed Waterbank Shelf, but we only got two stars because we don't have the tech to really flesh it out. Uh, so now we don't have much of a choice but to move on to Port End Avenue. Um, so here, let's see here, uh, Port End Avenue is quiet, uh, commuters at, uh, are unlikely to drop litter. All right, so still a fairly friendly sounding place anyway. I have no idea what the topo topography of this place looks like. So let's dive right in. Now, all of the unlocks that we got it from the previous uh, level carry over, including our employee. They carry over. Our money, on the other hand, is tr kept separate. Um, so whatever we made back then is kept in that that station's bank, and we have a fresh bank of um, uh, 12,000 uh, 12, pounds here. Uh, so let's look at this beast here. What do we got here? See, now, now we're dealing with some more complex stuff. We've got, uh, so our pre-made tracks here are, um, um, our pre-made station, that is, is right here in the middle, already kind of embedded, embedding itself in these, uh, um, in these tracks over here. We've got a couple of, uh, a couple of stations here. We've got Carnival Street, Brindle Street, um, now let me... Let me just make sure, because I think there's a way to uh, rotate our view here. Uh, let's see here, thermal imaging. Yes, there is heat that you need to track here. Oh, bugger, where, hang on. Okay, we're back. Q and E is what rotates our view here. So now I, I think rotating this way will give us a better view of things. So if you look at this, Brindle Street here is actually on the first floor. It's actually on the ground floor, but um, the um, there's another place, Carnival Street, which is actually uh, actually starts itself down below. So we've got two streets that are, are physically close to each other, but they're on different levels. Uh, not to mention we've got um, the uh, black line, the silver line here, um, which are, are both uh, one floor down. Um, so we need to ponder how to best utilize this. Because um, again, we have we have to use this station. The station is it forces us to start here, and obviously this water and these black tiles are blockers, so we need to be mindful. Uh, let's see here. All right. Well, this obviously this is this is fairly natural for for a uh, a, a train track here, uh, in terms of um, you know just getting getting stuff down here. I wonder maybe the the ground floor level stuff will be the public area and then the the track area the the place you go after you go through the turnstiles will be um the this the going down there i think that might be a smarter idea um but first things first we need to procure a few things we got 11 bonds to our name and we got new options now um let's see we can't um these look like they'll probably unlock once we start the level I was about to say, we kind of need staircases. We kind of need staircases, game. Please. Um, let's see if it lets me um, do a little floor sculpting. 
So that kicks our floor up a level here. Um, zero more bonds to unlock. I wonder if I have to actually go back to the original station here. I think I have to finish the uh, the day here. Okay, so what I need to do here in order to, um, I just realized, uh, but before we can start the next level, we need to finish the day here. Uh, so I'm gonna say play on. Um, And uh, we're just gonna yeah, let the let the day let the day run its course so that we can sort of lock in our um, our bonds here. Hmm. People want seats over here. Okay. Get a couple of seats over here in case people want that. Platform one is ready. Now get off of there. Call the train, please. All right, that should get us. We're, we're it's it's about to be nighttime here. Um, more technologies available to procure. Excellent. That's what unlocked everything. That's what I was waiting for. All right. Um, well, one thing I want to do here uh, to rest up our staff here. You're uh, Mia here. You're off shift. Yeah, oh, she's off shift. Oh, fair enough. That's okay. Um... Fair enough. Here, we'll just we'll, let's just finish the day. I think at uh, twenty-two. No. All right. Well, this place is going to get a little messy um, without our employee here to help manage things. But once the day ends. Let's get that train a, a, a flow in here. We can get a couple more bonds here to our name. Get some people out there. There it goes. Did did you? Uh, oh, there's a breakdown. Well, it's the end of the day anyway. Yeah, once it's when it's nighttime, eh, the whole station um, um, empties itself out. But there's no penalty to everybody leaving this way. Okay, well, there's uh, there's our day. Uh, so reputation um, today, journey complete, good. Overcrowded is the big thing. So when we come back here will need to. Okay, let's let's actually um, there we go and back to the map. All right, that's that's what we were needing. We were just needing it to to roll over and kick over um, some stuff so that we can actually build this station properly. I'm still getting used to this whole setup here. Okay, so, um, all right, we need to build this place up, and now that we have access to some, some more stuff, like, say, the staircase, that's kind of, that's something that I was waiting for here. Uh, footbridge, a second platform. Five bonds to pay for this thing, but I'm thinking that might be a smart thing to get. Because we've got, we're, we're basically being spoon-fed two different platforms here. Um, we want to, obviously, uh, yeah, there we go. 
Um, if we build platforms here... Uh, two carriage. We want to elongate this so that it gives us enough room for three carriages. But I don't want to do too much because otherwise I'm not going to have the money. Uh, add one more cell. All right. Thank nice of it to tell me uh, how many more cells I need to uh, uh, max length these things. Okay. Um... Actually, this works out really well just by itself. Like, if we have all of our public area up here, uh, both of these can sort of transition into it, uh, and then we'll have staircases coming down. I think that works out nicely. All right, so platforms. Max three carriages. Max three. You need to configure your stairs and turnstiles so the commuters can find their way to and from it. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Watch, watch this. So we're going to um, we're gonna edit floor. We're gonna kick these guys out, um, and then we're gonna sculpt floor and make you up here. Now, we're going to take those staircases that we got. Bada boom and a bada bing. Yeah, you know what? We're going to double side both of these tracks. Watch, watch this. Watch this and learn, folks. I've got, I got the ideas. All right, so first off, um, we're going to, um, Okay, so yeah, what um, we're 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 gonna we're gonna actually have them use both sides. Now these staircases, you are going to be um, yeah, you're 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 going down, you are going down. Both of these are going down, um, and then what we're gonna do with over here is the exits are going to be here and here. Sculpt you up one, sculpt you up one, um, and then we'll get those staircases like so. Staircase like so. And then you're going to go to the exit. And yeah, you're going up, you're going up to the exit. So people, people who are getting on board need to come down the middle and then get on either track, or regardless of which one they are doing. And then people who are leaving need to get off the train on both of these sides. That way it boards nice and efficiently. And then we can marry all these together. Um, we'll start with just Brindle Street, uh, see what the traffic is like. Because, I mean, Brindle Street, looks, you can see the commuter rate's a bit higher. I don't want to tap into Carnival Street just yet, um, just to make sure uh, that, we're, we, that we're okay here. All right, so let's edit floor. Um, yeah, like that. Uh, would it destroy too much money if I just did a nice big chunk? Uh, I think we'd be okay. We still need a lot of infrastructure here. Um, all right, so let's see. Turnstiles. We need turnstiles. All right, so you go here. Yeah, like that. Uh, and then where's, uh, I know we have fences here, there. That will keep them. So nice little, uh, nice little thing here. So you are going to go to track number two. You are going to go to track number one. 
No, actually, you know what? Um, can I, uh, can I destroy you during our setup phase without incurring... The, the game is very punishing about needing to move stuff in the middle of the day. Um, like, it, it angers your commuters when you have to do that. Um... Let me, um, yeah, I think, I, I think because we're, um, because we're, we're still, um, in closed mode, um, you know, there's nobody wandering around the station here. There we go. That's better. That's better. Okay. So now, now you're going to go to track number two. Um, so, and I like, look, look, the colors are corresponding. So this is going to the red track. This one's going to the yellow one. It's a nice touch. It's a nice touch. I like it. Um, and then here we just need um, we need turnstiles to prevent people from uh, going the incorrect way. Um, I guess we could just do something like this. And then do one, say, over here. Actually, this one works a lot. This one's a lot easier, like this. I like I like this. Can we do a, can we do a similar setup here, or is this the rotation not? Yeah, the rotation's not in our favor. That's fine. As long as as long as it works. Yeah, that's better. And then you. Um, Hey, that's a little ugly, but whatever. Okay, so you are going to go to the exit. And you are going to go to the... Nope. Other way, my friend. Go to the exit. That's more like it. All right, so now people can get on and off. Uh, now we need an entrance. Of course we need an entrance. Bada boom, bada bing. Configure, there is no route from platform two to exit. Yes, there is. Yes, there is. Um, let's see, get on left side, right side, or both commuters will not use the side with you. Yeah, it's gonna be, uh, it should be fine. Alright, well, I need, I need a utility room regardless, so, um... Where's my rooms? Infrastructure, utility, there we go. Utility room. Stick you. The three by four seems to be a pretty effective size here. I'm gonna have a feeling we're gonna need a few generators here. Like that. We'll buy the barrel later. Uh, Cause I have a feeling we're gonna be kind of shoestring here. There's no route from platform two to exit, platform one to exit. Yes, there is. I hope the AI can handle what I had in mind here. Um, right then, um, tool room. That's the other crit mission critical one that we need here. Uh, this one can be a three by three. Um, litter picker is gonna be just one of them. All right, what other things can we procure? We could we could go right for the three carriage train, but I think that might be a bit much. Uh, I know people get lost, so we need um, the map here. We could go for level two things. Um, plants are a good idea. 
Um, the PA is a good idea. Uh, you know what, I think I'm going to save my other stuff to see what kind of problems crop up. Because there is all sorts of problems that can crop up around here, and you need to have the tech to deal with them. Um, I do want to get my commerce down, because i got my newspaper tech. Uh, so, newspaper billboard, newspaper billboard. Um, and then we'll get a newspaper stand, say, uh, yeah, say right here. And we'll get a newspaper stand down here. Uh, let's see here. We, uh, we do want a map. We, we'll get a map down here, and we'll get a map up here. We'll get some uncomfy benches. Just for people to sit on. Uh, lighting. Um, oh, man. Actually, that kind of works out. Sort of. Yeah, no, that works out. And then this sort of works out. Sort of. Okay, good enough. Uh, ticket machines. People need to be able to buy tickets. Um, yeah, that makes sense. Um, ooh, I know what we can do. We'll get the uh, we'll put the ticket machine. Ooh, wow, we are really low on money. Uh, bins. How much? Hundred bucks. We're going to get one bin. <laughs> oh, I hope we have enough to open the station proper. All right, that gave us some cash. Okay. Um... We just pause so we can now we can actually get some stuff down here. Um, let's get the small plant. Small plant. We'll get we'll get people seeing these small plants. These help raise your reputation. Oops. Yeah, you're going up. You're going up. Did you hear there's no route from platform two to exit? Mm, we need more. Uh, we need more juice here. I figured we would be a little low on on that. Does that still require, um, hmm, okay, um, then another, uh, another generator then. There it goes, okay, we got enough, we got enough, uh, I mean, I hope they're smart enough to get off of the train in the proper direction. Because, yeah, they're technically allowed to use each of those. Alright, see, why did you guys... Why did you guys get off the train in that direction? Alright, I think there's some pathovers that we, we can build here, because there I I was I would think they would be yeah, footbridges here. We're gonna have to build these footbridges if we can afford them. I was 
trying to avoid having to build footbridges, but yeah. All right, well, fine. All right, um, the other thing we need is, uh, from procurement here, is, um, where is watering can? Because we have plants that are going to get thirsty here. All right, let's, um, let's buy our watering can here. I could also use the megaphone here to get people moving. And where's our staff member? We'll get you going there. Oh, we're low on power again? Man, these things are... this is a thirsty station. the litter picker. Oh yeah, let's, uh, I, f I almost forgot, let's get the, um, we need more bins, because we got that little bin down here, but we need more than just that. Uh, well, we, we th that'll be good enough. Really, really wish you guys were smart enough to just all get out at the correct side. But only a few of you know how to get out, how, how to properly leave. But still, getting uh, double barreled, um, double barreled things going here is pretty good. Um, oh yeah, let's, um, let's get you over here so you can start yelling at people to stop farting around. Because there is a lot of farting around here. Oh, there's a big line there. I see what the problem is. Please tell me we have enough power for that. There we go. Yeah, move it, people. Move it or lose it. Why are you unhappy? Uh, probably because I don't have a staff room for her. But we need some more cash. But we're getting more cash. We're getting it pretty quickly, actually. Um, how much is a 3x3 three three staff room? 180. Not bad. All right. We can afford to... Uh, we can do that. And then procurement. Um, water cooler. Vending machine. Chair. Get a couple of goodies for our staff member. They're they're a hard worker here. So water cooler. Uh, can't even afford the chair yet, but build medicine cabinet. A eh? somebody's sick. That's one of the things that can happen. Um, you don't need a ticket, dude. That's exit. Where the Sam heck are you talking about, dude? What is your deal? Are you trying to leave? Yeah, because that's the exit sign. It's not preventing people from leaving it. So I have no clue what that one person's deal is. Okay, we've got some more cash here. Let's uh, let's get that vending machine up. And the uncomfy chair. Uh, 
Um, why don't you take a break? There you go. Drinking, eating. Plenty of people moving and, and, and grooving here. I would have built this redundant uh, exit sign here um, if I had known. Um, yeah, there's there's the there's the map there. Uh, we need a uh, the the wheelie here. And then also the fuel barrel eventually here. All right, people seem to be doing pretty well. What's, um, that's a lot of despair. Your, um, every time your, your employee is tasked with doing something, they have a chance of failing. And when they, every time they fail, it raises despair. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm still trying to figure out here. So hunger, thirst, tiredness. Yeah, you know what? You're, you're good now. Um, why don't you, uh, why don't you go, uh, take care of that? Um, yeah, let's, uh, wow, we actually beat the station already? Interesting. Interesting. All right. Well, we were able to keep up with this one. Um, wow, we were one person away from the footfall bonus. You know what? I'm going to play until the end of the day here. Because that seemed to be uh, necessary here. Um, we're going to make the litter picker more important so that we uh, clean that stuff out. What are, what are these people going on about? About these no tickets. Uh, I'll have to look at that for next time. Um, this is going a lot better than the last time I did this uh, thing. I'm still trying to figure out what the Sam heck is going on. The bins are doing fine. Yeah, go yell at them. Yeah, once the end of the day ends, we'll... Uh, Pickpocket, aha! See, now I knew they were going to throw something new at me. Um, the staff with the caution or the taser tool can mete out swift justice to the uh, brigands. Okay, so let's, um, let's procure anti-theft stuff. Um, yeah, the crime, crime desk here. Caution tour to caution lawbreakers. Ah, the British way. Stop, or I'll say stop again. Then again, I, I shouldn't be making fun here because it's uh, better than the American way of just killing them and asking questions later. But I digress. Um, can we hire another person? Because we're getting a lot of people. Yeah, there we go. Hen Henry Power. Henry Power. Um, we, we are not powerful enough to hire Henry Power. Uh, so uh, Miss Brown's going to have to pull double duty here. Um, let's, um, yeah, let's get rid of the megaphone and then have you equip the caution tool. Um, now let's see if we can't find the ne'er-do-well.
Nope, alright, well, it's a little late to find the ne'er-do-well, because everybody's going home. Alright, well, at least we're making a comparable amount of money here. Oh, one other tool that we're going to need here. And I just realized, yeah, we're going to need... Uh, Journey complete. Lots of lots of journey completes. Lots of aesthetic gains. A few overcrowded, but not too bad. Uh, some gloomies. We may need to uh, pop a few uh, uh, pop a few things here, but uh, actually not too not too bad at all. Um, all right. Well, I think this station worked out, even though it's not exactly um, the. I, I, it wasn't it the AI didn't quite treat it as as clever as I'd like to have thought it would have been, but eh, it worked. So if you guys like this episode and you want to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave me a comment. Good, bad, or indifferent. Your feedback's always welcome. So until next time, this has been Pinstar signing out. See ya!